But we also should talk about that Chilean thing real fast, really quickly. Remember the Eddie Vedder guy? Eddie Vedder. I believe he's a singer for Pearl Jam. He is a good singer. <laughs> uh, I don't like the documentary as much as I, 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 I did when I first saw it. Pearl Travis Jam. hates it. Who? Hates the band. Who? Travis, yeah, he's not a big Pearl fan Jam. of Pearl Jam. Yeah. Pearl Jam uh, 20, I saw the documentary, and I, I liked it because I, I really do like Pearl Jam a lot. But now I don't really like the documentary because I'm really frustrated by not learning anything about Eddie Vedder. And yeah. then Travis is like, well, he's a private person. And I told Travis, I'm like, well, then, then don't agree to do a documentary. Yeah. A documentary likes to pry into your life and, 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 and find out some shit. It documents you. Right. <laughs> it documents what you do. And if you're a private person, then don't yeah. do the documentary. Kind of silly. It is, I mean, it is good, though. But What uh, do I, we know about Eddie Vedder's personal life? Not much. Anything about any chicks or he's short dudes or this something? I know. What what do we know? And I've I've been a fan since pretty much day one. Um, he's short. Mm -hmm. He was raised by a guy he thought was his father, but that guy turned out to not be his biological father. Now how you find this shit out? And then his biological father was always around. Yeah, but he just knew him as that guy. Wow. And uh, he likes to surf. Oh, he's a surfer. And. Wow. And that's it. That's all I know about Eddie oh, Vedder. Oh, well, look who comes in when he hears Eddie Vedder. What do you know, <laughs> Travis? How long have you uh, been into Pearl Jam? Uh, what, 15, 16 years? Okay, yeah. 15, what? 16 years. Simple question. Yeah. Tell us everything you know about Eddie Vedder. Well, he's an attractive man with a very good voice. <laughs> <laughs> See? He's married. He has two kids. He does. Oh, yeah. how, okay. old is, how old is his kids? Uh, younger than him. Younger than him, yeah. good. Uh, and you're seriously, what do you know about this guy? He likes surfing. And he was, and they just did a documentary. <laughs> he didn't know his real dad. Yeah, I said that yeah. part. But look, it, 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 the documentary was was billed as a celebration of their twenty years. It's not, you know. Yeah, but the, I don't even know if expose on on. Oh, but I don't even know if the, the band, band likes each other anymore because they really they weren't filmed together. Yeah. For this documentary, Travis, you know that. Yeah, they like each other. But the, why weren't they filmed together? I don't know. You and, have to and, ask Cameron Crowe. And they, and they touched on the fact that Eddie Vedder doesn't even really travel with the band anymore. He likes to, what, jump oh, in his uh, boy. Jump in, uh, tour bus or something? Well, I mean, you know, he, he used to go out on, on the road by himself and do his little radio show. <laughs> yeah, so now he travels by but himself. That, that was, so what's that, that about? Radio. But they didn't people do that. But they didn't explain it. You guys don't go to events together. Oh, no, we don't like each other anymore. Well, oh. <laughs> we just know that we could make a lot of money if we stick together. Oh, yeah, so. <laughs> you don't heard it. There it was. There it was. <laughs> <laughs> So maybe Pearl no. Jam is all right, all the kidding. opium Anthony of, of grunge No, music. all kidding aside, I would easily answer that question. Our lives have become very different. Well, and I we, mean, and they we, all have kids. They're all married. And they we all have different stuff. And Ant lives on Long Island. I'm here in the city. So it, it's just different now. I, I, I don't dislike Anthony whatsoever. Yeah, it's but just one of those. Uh, well, exactly. We're very I mean, different people. Yeah. But is that, the, is that what's going on with Pearl Jam? I, I, would, I would assume so. Look, without... So why didn't they explain that? Or do they hate each other? And they know it's a it's a it's a it's a really good business model still. So they stick together for that reason. I mean, look, after a while, like I don't think a lot of bands that are around for twenty years still travel in the same bus together. And you know, mm. you know, you know, like I'm I'm pretty sure that that's a common thing. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think, think the Metallica role... does. No, absolutely not. No, no, no. Mm, okay. Why not? You, you get to the venue by yourself. That you kind of does make room. sense. It's like at first you're all like, yeah, we're a band. Let's fucking yeah. tour. We'll do that. And then, and then after 20 years, you're probably just like, eh, get to yeah, the gig. I'll, I'll see, see you at the gig. We'll do sound check. We'll... See you on stage. Yeah. That's sort of, <laughs> I, don't, that's... I don't think that's out of the ordinary at all. Very similar to this radio show. Yeah. When we first part. started, we were like on the phone all day with each other. Car hanging pulled out. in. Car pulled in. It's because we lived like fucking a block away from Drinking each other. Drinking uh, before, during, and after the show together. Yes. Vacation we would, together. We would Vacation do it. Together. Yeah. Vacation together. Vacation together. Vacation together. I mean, look, even even when, when we all started like six years oh, ago, you know, we would, we would hang out all the time oh, after the show. Oh, my God. See what happens? What happened there? It doesn't happen anymore. Oh. Never. No. Oh boy. <laughs> I think the last time but, uh, we all hung out was when we were all very excited that Danny was going to fail with his Dave Mustaine autograph. Right. Yeah, that was. <laughs> oh, Sam's mic ain't on. Oh, sorry. Uh, uh, but, that was our last like bonding sorry. moment. That was it. Following Danny around. 
uh, all bonding with his together. guitar. Oh, and he had his guitar yeah. riding around with a guitar. The epic fail yeah. with yeah. David Mustaine. Yeah. And Sam and I commented that this was the first time we had been downstairs together in oh, years. Oh, that's right. We were outside the building <laughs> on the sidewalk, being social. The three of us together. And then you realize, like, wow, we don't do this. No. We used to do it at a point, though. Yeah. That was, uh, well, I remember the uh, old building at XM when I used to come out to leave. All you guys would be standing around smoking your cigarettes yeah. or and we, uh, yapping to each even other. Even the non-smokers. Yeah. Well, like, I would go down and hang out oh, while yeah. they were smoking. Yeah. Out, in, like fr nothing. out in front of the building. We would go to bars after the show. And, yeah, you know. yeah. Now, well, now you're, you know, now we've all got our own a, things. You're going a dad. On. I'm a dad. Sam's got ten radio shows. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sam, very busy with that. Engaged. Yeah. Were you Engaged. crying on one of your radio shows yesterday? On the after show, I got emotional. Oh, About no. what? Bob oh, no. Kelly. Uh, oh no. He had touched me... you funny? No, he didn't touch me funny. Yeah, <laughs> he touched you. He had me break down uh, what my feelings were. You don't have feelings. Well, we that's, know that that's by kind now. of true. That's what he thought. So you're kind of robotic. Oh. I'm not robotic. Here you are. I'm not robotic. That's not what I sound like. Stop <laughs> oh, it. Stop sorry. it. <laughs> He's getting all upset again. Are I, you trying to uh, rip off other radio shows? No. It was, uh, Did you actually get emotional? No. <laughs> no, I was no. joking. No, no. Totally right, kidding. Good. So I'm my point, Travis, <laughs> if people cared enough to have an O&A documentary, we would explain some of this stuff. Mm. In this, the Pearl Jam 20, they didn't explain anything. Like, they're, the band was pretty much being interviewed separately, so that made me very suspicious. Oh. Then Eddie Vedder really didn't add much of anything. It was almost like he didn't even want to be part of this thing, but said, all right, you can film me for a little, little bit here and there. And I didn't learn anything about, uh, about the band in general. He's a Cubs fan. Oh, how about they fucking show him with a Cubs hat on? Well, he's he's very he's gone to Cubs fantasy camp. I think I think Cameron Crowe is a little overrated. I think Cameron, yeah, huh? well, I really yeah. do think he's a little overrated. He, Why are you he, looking around? Is he here today? No, yeah. I'm just I think he might be that. a little overrated. I, a little I, too cool I, for the room. Like, look what I could do, man. Yeah, I've been yeah in, I mean, look, I've he, been in rock my whole life. Yeah, ever since I was a kid. You see the movie about me? The fucking yeah. movie, the documentary, the first 20 to 30 minutes, amazing. Just explaining the whole Seattle uh, scene and how this band was doing this and this. And they had, then Eddie's over here. And that, the, how it all came together was great. Look, it's definitely, And then it just kind of sat there, this damn thing. It's definitely not my favorite documentary oh I've no not seen. even close they really skimmed over the last 10 years which are the more important 10 years i think the in... last 10 years was probably 20 minutes of the film wow probably Isn't right that kind of important it, it i think it's extremely important because it, it it shows how a band that's no longer you know like at Relevant? the top of the charts yeah. oh, okay. is still selling out <laughs> arenas you know nationwide they didn't really selling out is the big word <laughs> but they didn't really explain that travis is right exactly this is a band that Basically went away as far as mainstream listening to the radio type yeah. of bands go, right? Yeah, they'll have like in you all know, fairness, they'll normally have one to two singles on on each. But album. they but they didn't do a lot of interviews. No, but and they were selling kinda, millions of records. They were kind of in the shadows, but all of a sudden you learn out of nowhere that they never stopped touring and they're selling out wherever the fuck they go. Yeah. Mm. So what changed and how do they make that happen? I mean, I know, but it's not. They well, brought a documentary about it, right? <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> no, they no didn't answers. explain anything. They kind of <laughs> took yeah. on it's like kind of like once once Vitology, you know, ended the the movie was almost right. Like, okay, now 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 over. Right. Yeah, they kind of did a Grateful Dead thing where they really Absolutely. got serious about their touring and allowing their fans to tape and all that shit and mm. and uh, creating this kind of culture around mm -hmm. the band that not a lot of bands are able to do. Yeah, but I mean, you wouldn't know that. From you wouldn't know that. Like they did a quick little like I've been to ten Pearl Jam shows. I've been to a hundred like right. you know oh. fans. But like that was it. And I'm and I'm hoping like the DVD comes out on Tuesday, and there's a lot of extras. Right. And oh, so you're hoping the extras are the better. movie. It's yeah, not I mean, just filler. Like, look, there's there's a special the edition that's are like the movie. three have... discs and like Jesus. One of it is you know that? like an extended practically different movie like that deals mm -hmm. with the fans and stuff. So um, oh really? Yeah. Well, maybe uh, in in this circumstance, the extras are actually better than the film. Well, they they said that they were m making the DVD geared towards the hardcore fan. So yeah, okay. uh, mm -hmm. so, yeah. See, they probably edited it in a way that, like, okay, we got to have mass appeal a little bit. Let's just keep it simple. And then the uh, they released the the extended one and leave a bunch of shit in for people that are like, you know, when does this Travis? come out? The DVD? Yeah, Tuesday. Is it going to have a whole concert on there? Uh, it has all of the <laughs> all of the concert footage that was in the film, right? 
there there's a disc that has all the full. Oh God! <laughs> all right. Oh no, I, 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 I'll enjoy it. But well, I, yeah. I, I, I want to learn about it. Hey, it's better. cool for me. There were two shows that I was at in the movie. I, I like. Oh, I just want to learn about yourself. <laughs> no. Oh, no. okay. It's on PBS tonight. Everybody should watch it. PBS. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we could discuss it on Monday. Sure. But, but anyway. We made the Chilean news, and it has something to do with Eddie Vedder. You remember the guy from, uh, uh, what's the name of the show? Mi Mi nombre es. 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 Why mi nombre? Hombre is something else. Hombre would be a... I thought hombre was named. Pistolero? I took six years of Spanish. Hombre is named. Oh, really? I don't know. Incorrect. Hombre. Nombre. Mi nombre es. Mi nombre es. Which is this uh, Chilean show where these guys try Chilean. To... Chilean. They're saying, uh, someone said Chilean. It's, is it cold in there? <laughs> Did I say Chilean? <laughs> yeah. Ah, fuck. Chilean. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm. Chilean. Chile. Chile. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, they did a follow-up story on this guy, I yeah, guess. Yeah, this guy sounds just like Eddie Vedder, and uh, we made the what? Chilean? Uh, Chilean. The Chile. Ooh. The Chile news. The news from Chile. The Chile <laughs> news. Uh, we made the news, and uh, they used some audio from our show. Well, the, yeah, because the story was about uh, Chris Cornell recognizing the talents of this singer, and they used the YouTube footage that the Sirius XM team had uploaded of our show. Right on. Let's hear it. On the ceiling, on a person. This is the sound of life, which is just ridiculously amazing. Gracias a YouTube, amazing. Chris Cornell, uno de los cantantes más Chris Cornell. Leather, vio la presentación de Javier cuando en un programa de radio en Estados Unidos se la mostraron. United States Radio Satellite Radio. Oh my God, that's pretty amazing. I swear, I thought they, they were... And there's someone listening and getting ready to judge it. Yeah, yeah. That'd be worth doing at an actual Pearl Jam show just for a minute. Another talking to the guy. He can't believe it. He's like, oh my god. Is that what he's saying? Imitator. Do you know Spanish, Sam? Un poco. Then tell us what the. Then tell us what the fuck this guy's saying. He's smiling, so he enjoyed the fact that Chris Cornell is digging him. He's speaking Chilean, so there are some differences, but different dialects that you don't quite get. Yeah, is it it's some like of that Klingon at the uh, geek fests yeah. that you go to. Where the fuck is Mars? We finally need him. Get he that... doesn't know how to yeah, speak Spanish. Yeah. I can probably oh, please. get that dirty. You know what? In here. Oh. What do you mean he doesn't know? He doesn't know anything about Spanish. They're like, damn, that's <laughs> a good language. <laughs> damn, he talks good. <laughs> he don't know Spanish. No, he doesn't know Spanish. He knows Spanish worse than he knows English. And he can't how speak do you not English. Know Spanish? You don't know Spanish. He doesn't really know Spanish well. Motherfucker has no idea what he's talking Sword about. Puerto Rican. Yeah. He's Damn, all... he's a good liar. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> all right. Well, oh, well translate oh. translate this shit for us. Right, Go on. back to the uh, Chris Cornell right after the I'll Chris Cornell he part. I has no idea. He's going to make it up. I'll, I'll... All right, right there. It's okay. good. Yeah, right. We had subtitles. Now, you know how I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to I'm gonna do what they do on TV. I'm going to turn down the audio a little bit so the Spanish is in the background, and you're going to translate as best oh, you can. That's good. Okay. All right, here all right. we go. Get well. ready. No me pasé nunca por la mente, ¿cachai? Que podía llegar a él a ver, ¿cachai? Mi presentación. Su voz. He says, No, that's not how it works. You ever see a translator at like the UN or something or on TV? They have the guy giving the speech, and at the same time, the translator is talking with the underlying speech going on underneath. Yeah. That's going nowhere right now. That's not going to happen. No? No. I'm not going to have to stop and I translate. Spanish isn't that strong. All right. No, because I got. Whatever. He says it never crossed his mind or imagined that it could have gone up to that level. Well, Damn, uh, that's Chris- a good translation. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's continue. Oh, so far, so good. Sorprendió al líder de Sun Garden y hasta el día de hoy es una revolución en las redes sociales. Este fue el primer grupo que se creó en Facebook para apoyarlo y en una semana tenía 7000 seguidores. Bueno. If you don't have the word Soundgarden in your translation, you're fired. <laughs> it's the only there. word I recognize. But she she said a lot. Can you go back just a little no. bit? No. Uh, we don't want to summarize. spend all day on Basically this. Basically what summarize. she's saying yeah, is... Yeah, summarize. Go ahead, go I heard 7,000 followers. Just go back a little bit. There, there, go. Okay. Go ahead. 
but a rip. Líder de Sun Garden y hasta el día de hoy es una revolución en las redes sociales. Este fue el primer grupo Seamos. que se creó en Facebook para apoyarlo y en una semana tenía 7000 seguidores. So this is the first time that uh, they use Sound Garden and it it became a social uh, a social event where there was the first group that used Facebook to reach out to the people. It was a revolutionary. Yeah, he didn't get that right at all. I uh, mean, that didn't even make what, sense, what, what she what, said. What, what, first what? time they used Soundgarden. They didn't use no, it. No, Facebook. They, you, said sound, for, you said this is the first time they've <laughs> used Soundgarden. Soundgarden used uh, Facebook, oh, too. This, this is the people. first time Soundgarden's ever been on Facebook. What? No, that's what, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> that translation is completely wrong. It's horrible. <laughs> what are you saying? This is either the worst <laughs> news network ever or the translation is completely oh, wrong. Maybe this is some <laughs> dumb college news station then. He's saying Soundgarden is leading the Facebook revolution. Wait, what? All right, go back. Go what? back. What? We, do have, we do have someone on line three, though, that uh, yeah. says uh, that they could translate because that right. idiot go, doesn't know anything. Give him another chance yeah. with Soundgarden be the yeah, first yeah. something. Yeah. She speaks fast. Whatever. <laughs> she speaks fast. Su voz sorprendió al líder de Soundgarden. Her, his voice surprised the leader of Soundgarden. That's not it at all what you said before. Yeah, yeah I know. El día de hoy es una revolución en las redes sociales. Okay. Este fue el primer grupo que se creó en Facebook para apoyarlo. Go. En una semana tenía right there. 7 mil seguidores. Okay. See, this is the first group <laughs> that used Facebook. To be supported, and, and who, first who week was? it had. I think she pointed. Soundgarden what she, wasn't the first. What she's saying is, this Facebook. is what she said. She said this is the first Facebook group for him, and in a week had seven thousand followers. Okay, so so this is his Facebook. His Facebook has nothing to do not, with not Soundgarden. Soundgarden. Uh, no, uh, Facebook that, page for him. That is the first group that was made to support. All right, him. Hold on, we got right. we got not Soundgarden. We got G. <laughs> is it G or G? G. G. What's up, G? Yeah. yeah. Um, I think Sam got it right. Well, that's good. <laughs> Sam got so, it right. And Mars is like, right. no, that's, you said Soundgarden was revolutionizing <laughs> Facebook so, or see, something. Those cool. <laughs> right. Ah. You're talking to that Puerto Rican dummy. Oh, oh wow. Oh, You're going to take that, Mars? Nice. That's not nice. Damn, that's a good insult. All right, G, G stay on the line. And, and Sam, shut up, because yeah. you obviously know more Spanish than you're leading on to. Well, you I just wanted to set Mars up. Actually, Mars you could pretty Spanish much. Family. And you know why? He can't speak English. You know why? Why baby boy Sam knows Spanish? Why? Mother? Not mother. Oh. He nanny? was raised by a nanny. I had a Spanish housekeeper. Oh, he's God. a rich he's little. A, he kid, is a rich kid. little spoiled brat who should be down at that stupid park. Listen, <laughs> but his dad has decided not to, you know, move the money to Sam. Ah, Sam's got to do yet. it on his own. Not yeah. yet. You inherit it. So you know Spanish. I see. <laughs> he didn't want to lead on. I think if you could make out two or three words in these sentences, you know the context of the that's conversation, what and that's what kind of makes it easier to figure out by yourself. Even you if you don't speak the language, I could right. never speak like that or anything. But right. You, you, All right, Mars. If, 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 put, says, put it this way: if that was just audio and right. you knew nothing of this story, yeah. you would not know what the fuck she said at all. Right. But since you know the story, you're seeing video. You're seeing the the you know the image of Facebook and this guy. You could kind of figure it out. But Mars picked up on all the wrong keywords and just pieced the story entirely <laughs> Piece wrong. He smelled it together wrong. Did Mars basically <laughs> say Soundgarden was revolutionizing he said, Facebook? This is or the something. first time Soundgarden has been on Facebook. It's Soundgarden, no, it's a big event. <laughs> I used Facebook. All right, Damn, let's try. That's a good social network site. <laughs> all right, let's try some more. We got G on the line to help us out, and obviously Sam who speaks it fluently. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Bueno, perdíame es eh, uno de mis grupos favoritos. Que por eso cree la cree ese esa página, digamos, en apoyo a Javier. Okay, that's one of his favorite groups, and that's why they're supporting that group and that, what they're going for. G? Oh, my God. What did he just say? <laughs> what, Mars, what did you say? <laughs> that, that that's one of his favorite groups. Well, that's a different guy talking, so I don't know what that yeah, guy, wait a minute. Who is. Okay, who said that? Okay, this is a different person that they're talking to now, not the guy who's saying. Not the guy oh. who sounds like Eddie Vedder? Right. Okay. Oh, okay. This is Eduardo Contrardo, and he, I believe, put together the Facebook page for Javier Your Diaz. Because yeah. I'm seeing, like, I could just figure it out just by looking at the right. where the words are. But <laughs> Mars, that's what he is. Uh, Mars said page. what? Right. Mars, but he said, sure. Mars said this is one of his favorite groups, so he made a group to support that group. <laughs> <laughs> group, group, but he group, group. <laughs> Groupy, group, 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 group. group. I th yeah, uh, I uh, G, what do you get out of that? 
Um, what Sam said, because I, I can't I can't tell who's talking. But anyway, um, should we go back one more time? All right, listen, yeah, listen closely. Yeah, let's and let Mars up. have Mars has the first shot, and then G. All right. That's fair. And Sam, okay. who uh, obviously speaks fluent, uh, yeah. Yeah. Go, shut the fuck yeah. up. Go. All right, hit it. Siete mil seguidores. Bueno, perdíame es eh, uno de mis grupos favoritos. Que por eso creé la creé ese, esa página, digamos, en apoyo a Javier. Pearl Jam is one of his favorite groups. That's why he made that page. No, he likes... The, I even know. The page is made for the guy that imitates Pearl right. Jam. The guy made the Facebook page for that guy who sounds like Eddie Vedder. <laughs> not but, Pearl but he's Jam, a fan of that guy, not Pearl Jam. G, Just, help me out. Yeah. G, okay. is that what happened? He said that it is one of his favorite groups and that he made the Facebook page uh, for Javier. Mm -hmm. Because it was a machine, uh, so he had to. I figured uh, here's he what did it, he he did it to support him. The last support part, Javier. The last part of the sentence was hard to figure out. Yeah, and so Mars just heard the first part about Pearl Jam, and he created group group any group any group. And then he just made groupity, up the group, rest. group group group. I'm trying group. to make it easy for you guys. <laughs> Oh, yeah. No, oh, are you Mars? Yes. Because you notice in Mars' description of what that guy said, <laughs> yeah. Javier was not mentioned once, and the word machine wasn't even brought up. Oh. All right. Yeah, let's, he, he didn't say Javier. Let's go back. Did he say Javier? Uh, well, we know it's G about ha Javier. Javier. But because it's a that Javier. Oh, look at the chick that's bashing you, by the way. Oh. Is she fine? It's her on the phone right there. Let me see. Oh, wow. Yeah, oh, she look, look at the camera. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah. You've been on our show before. I love yes, technology. I, love. I remember G. Hola, Opie. <laughs> <laughs> She's I. She's I. She's I. Mars, you want to continue with this? Go ahead. Let's go. All oh, right. oh, damn. Oh, shit. Let's, All go. Right, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. That's a good challenge. <laughs> 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 so glad Danny brought that. To the table. Oh, it's one of the funniest things ever. <laughs> it really is. All right, let's go. Let me start over. Okay. All right, Mars, focus now. <laughs> they believe you're in a bodega, and you got to work. Do you think Mars can oh, pass shit. the Spanish <laughs> Regents test? Uh, <laughs> I don't think so. All right, let's go. Uh, I think Speedy Gonzalez is in trouble now. <laughs> All right, here we go. Eso cree la cree ese esa página digamos en apoyo a Javier. Precisamente la de Javier. That was the end. That was where Mars just insisted I, that that guy never said Javier. Well, I said support him. And the last word you was said, Javier. 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 Was the last okay. Word. okay. Okay. Back to okay. the guy. It sounds like anybody. Now it's another guy. We're on. Eso cree la cree ese esa página digamos en apoyo a Javier. Precisamente la derrota de marzo lo llevó a tomar una gran decisión. Quiero volver. All right. Okay. Um, the dethroning of Marso, whoever Marso is. Oh, so she, that word is thrown in there. Yeah. Words aren't all of a sudden thrown Who's in Marso, there. Though? It's Mars. Mars. <laughs> <laughs> all right, go ahead. Uh, go back a little bit more. This, this, is some... a you know, this is the beginning of the clip. Oh, okay. Okay. Precisamente la derrota de Marso lo llevó a tomar una gran decision. All right. Wow, you're because, sweating, man. Because of the dethroning of Marshall, that's why he made the decision to go ahead and do this. I think she said he's going to have a big decision. He made a big decision. He made a big decision. All right. Uh, G? Um, oh, my God. I can't believe he's... Who's Marso? Marso is March. Oh. Idiot. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait a month. <laughs> you don't even know how to say You don't even know how to say the months in Spanish. <laughs> she just threw that word in out of nowhere. I'm just, <laughs> Damn, that's a good translation. Um he um he, <laughs> he went, he went uh, Sorry. bankrupt in March and that that was one of the reasons why he made that big decision. He had to make it. <laughs> oh, oh he went bankrupt. Make the decision yeah. to go on the show? Yeah. Okay, so that's not what, at all what Mars said. And what did said. Mars say again? He, Mars said... Who's Mars? So? Wait. Mars said that because of dethroning Mars, <laughs> he's, he's made a decision. <laughs> I, I told you, Mars doesn't know Spanish or English. <laughs> oh, you gotta be banned. I got send someone to Black Island. <laughs> Mars, Mars, yeah. listen to me. Continue. I'm Puerto Rican, too, so I'm allowed to bash you. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Mar everyone is saying Marso is March. All right. We're almost done. We're, we made the news down there in Chile. <laughs> Apparently. I guess. Yeah. Lo llevó a tomar una gran decisión. Quiero volver a mi nombre por la rancha. Con ganas de. What did he say? 
You want me to continue? No. Uh, he, or would you go back? Go back. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, geez. He's in trouble. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, boy. Tell me when to stop. Okay. Okay. Decision. Quiero volver a, a, a mi nombre por, por la ranch. He wants to return to the name for the for the ranch. He wants to return to his name for the ranch, whatever the fuck the ranch is. Wait, wait. Maybe he wants to go back on mi nombre es. I think I he. Let me listen. <laughs> he went. He went to go. <laughs> let me listen. Let me listen. Cause oh, Mars. Oh boy. Lo llevó a tomar una gran decisión. Quiero volver a a, a mi nombre por por la ranch. Con... All right. What is what is it, Mars? So I want to return to my name for the for the ranch. For the ranch? <laughs> he says, ranch, rancho. I, for the ranch? Ranch, ranch, ranch. Oh, I Why? thought he needed a wrench for something. No, Damn, no, no, no. that's a good tool. <laughs> Why would you say ranch if you don't know what he's saying? He wants rancho. to return to his name for the ranch. For the ranch. Okay. Rancho, I, I don't understand. Uh, I don't know what Sam, ranch is. Uh, I think he's saying something about, like, he wants to... To, to regain his name as, as I, I don't know without the full context of the sentence so maybe he wants to go back on the show and regain his name regain, or re, regain his title yeah or something. Uh, I, I don't uh, know Jay, what do you got on that uh, he wants to go back on mi nombre is to, uh, oh, it's the oh, name of the show. Yes, yeah, 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 the yeah. name of the show. I, I yeah, no, yeah. I'm a, yeah, he wants to go back. No, I'm just. Doing I got that. Too. I messed up on that. Too. You're doing it badly. You said now, ranch. Did he, did he lose? Like his ranch or something? He I mean, must. He must have lost his ranch in the bankruptcy. Oh, like, that's context. But Morris said ranch. Wow. No, yeah. I did not say ranch. You said ranch. You said ranch. ranch. All right, then he wants his ranch back. I didn't mean no ranch, Morris man. We talked about said ranch. ranch. Okay, okay, so we would never say ranch so, if you meant ranch. So G said he wants to go back on mi nombre es. To, so he can get his ranch back. Right. Mars said he wants to return to his name <laughs> so he can get the ranch. Mars is like a little kid in Spanish class who just literally translates each right. word each <laughs> instead of recontexting and put it into sentence. context. Yeah. Right. right. Well, he wants to get his name back so he can get his wrench back. <laughs> his ranch. Because he needs his name. Yo soy en la biblioteca. Tú eres un maricón. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. All right. That's unkind. All right, we're almost done. Okay. Comments coming in that people want to hit Mars with a wrench. <laughs> yes, uh, with El Rancho. <laughs> El Rancho. El Rancho. Uh, yes. All right, let's go, Mars. You can do this. A mi nombre es por por la rancha. Con ganas de de seguir avanzando, ¿cachai? Y y poder hacer algo más que es lo que se hizo en la primera etapa. With the desire to uh to go on and uh uh, achieve his goals and the last part I didn't, uh, okay. I didn't catch. by the way someone a lot of people saying after his defeat in March he wants to return to the show that's what yeah that's so right. I guess uh, someone uh, finally defeated him on the show yeah so he, 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 he didn't win he, right he didn't do well. all right uh, I think you go straight to G for that one because more I mean <laughs> wait what did Mars say Sam it was just insane say play it again. okay let's play, play it again Can you play it again yeah, yeah sure. all right because he's talking a little no, low. no, no it's too much too much too much, okay. too much. oh damn too much a, a mi nombre es por, por la rancha. Con ganas de, de seguir avanzando, ¿cachai? Y, y poder hacer algo más que es lo que se hizo en la primera etapa. With uh, a desire to continue going and, and progressing. Um, doing, doing, doing celebrity imitations. Yeah, I would just go to G on this. Right? <laughs> he's going <laughs> to no achieve great things. Oh, yeah? He has the desire to go on. And um, I Mars, that one you got right. Thank you. Oh, yeah, but it. fucking Sam, shut up. Yeah, Sam. You say shit. How did you help them there? Sam no. helped You think him. I listen to this? You mother? saw that? Oh damn! You, you don't listen, listen to him? Get the fuck. He derails me all the time. You think I fucking <laughs> listen to him? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Look how proud he is. But I think Sam no. helped him. I, you can't help yourself. Don't help okay. this right. this guy. You're right. You're right. Can I control the mouse? No, can you can't control. control. <laughs> what? What would that matter? El It'll mouse. matter a lot. <laughs> El mouse. El Damn, mouse. Damn, that's a good mouse. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted that as a pet. <laughs> Sorry, Sam. Mouse I yelled at you. No, 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 no. I know Mother's not gonna be happy with me. She'll be all right with that. She, I, I, do. I think you were helping him though. She, you don't help him. Okay. Hey, G, let him flounder. Do you say ratón for a uh, computer mouse in Spanish? No. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. See, I don't, I don't know what. Yeah. I don't know. Hey, I need a new optical rat. <laughs> no, I, I <laughs> rat. I got this rat. He can't even relate to his fellow Puerto Rican. <laughs> That's hilarious. She's like, no. This is the most well, insane I, thing because how the whole thing that? has been that Mars can't pronounce anything in English. Right. And the assumption has been that's because of a language barrier. Right, because it's his second language. But he has language. a touch rat. He was born in America and he can't speak Spanish either. <laughs> <laughs> he can't 
has, he has that. Why would you look that way uh, if you can't speak Spanish? Jesus. He has that uh, <laughs> Puerto Rican Spanish. That's got to suck. You look that way and you can't speak the language. Either language. Look what way? Uh, you know, you look kind of Hispanic. What, what, I don't understand what you mean by that, Opie. It I think he's talking like, about like those people. Let him speak. Those yeah. people. Yeah. Yeah, what, what are if those you look that way, you should, you should be able to speak Spanish. Oh man, <laughs> I really look uh, I really look Puerto Rican to you. Brown skinned, uh, yeah, not yeah, really. Yeah, yeah, no, not much. really, right? You could be a you, few things. Like I, you could. I don't know. You could. You could almost Italian. pass for an Italian. Yeah, I've heard that. Yeah. And Middle Irish. Eastern. Irish. Middle Eastern. <laughs> Middle Italian Eastern or Irish. Irish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you grew you, your hair out, you could look like Gaddafi. I told you that this morning. A little Middle, Middle Eastern. I did tell you that, right? North yes, African. That was a compliment, right? Compliment. Gaddafi is not a handsome <laughs> man. <laughs> Just don't say he looks Dominican. That's really offensive. Dominican. Yeah, we know yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. PR, PR yeah, like, taught us that years ago. Yeah. Puerto Ricans and Dominicans, they don't, don't really get, get along, along well. Man. That's for sure. And you don't want to no. be called Mexican either, right? No, we're not. See, I know that too, Marcy. No. I'm with you, my brother. Mm -hmm. Those Mexicans. Are uh, you ready for the rest of this? All right. Yeah. How much more we got? 40 seconds. I didn't understand that. We already did that. that we already one. did that one. We already did that one, remember? <laughs> you, already, you already translated that oh, incorrectly. Why did he that. translate it as Your again? Lord. I don't even remember. Okay. Ya está entre los más de 8,000 inscritos y espera ansioso ver nuevamente al jurado. Wow. <laughs> she said, she wow. said uh, uh, a certain number of subscribers, but I didn't get that number. All right. Um, All right, I'm going to play it again. again. Okay. No. Gee, you listening? Yeah, play it again. Okay. We're playing it again. Ya está entre los más de 8,000 inscritos y espera ansioso ver nuevamente al jurado. Did you say uh, octo mil or I don't know octo mil is eight thousand or eighty thousand? No, no, <laughs> ocho mil. Ocho, yeah. did, but I didn't yeah. hear ocho. I heard octo. I heard ocho. <laughs> Everyone heard ocho. Oh my god! <laughs> I heard ocho. You even got Puerto Rican ears. <laughs> oh, uh, all right, Mars. What does it say? That they got um eight thousand subscribers. <laughs> and I got stuck on that. <laughs> <'Cause> I was, <laughs> you, you came I down the hall. Mil. You came down the hall all confident, like, damn, they finally need me for something. No, I can translate. I came down the hall. Watch what the, I do now. No, I, they finally need no. me. I came down the hall because the boss called me in. You're supposed to be the minority Zim. influence on the show. That's right. That's like, true, the show yeah. needs that. All right, yeah. uh, G. What what was said there? So that the. Um, the show has 8,000 contestants. Yeah. And, oh, <laughs> of course. Oh. And, Wait, uh, did you didn't say contestants. She said subscribers. You said subscribers. Right. A thousand like, subscribers. Even like Anthony was saying, like, yeah. even you could figure out contestants because what were they showing on the television? Contestants. Yeah, contestants. So why are they talking about So if there was a number and you see a lot of people, I would probably assume exactly. 8,000 people are trying out for the show. Context has a lot to do yeah. with it. Yeah. All right, let's continue. So eight. Okay. Al jurado. Yo siento que en la primera pasada hubo un, un, más que un tema de voz, hubo un tema de actitud. Ok, stop. He says since the, in the beginning, mm -hmm. it's more than, um, than a, uh, a theme of, a, a voice theme, it's a theme of act, uh, attitude. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing these literal like <laughs> yeah, word yeah. for word. What, like, I, can't you take those words and put it in your, your see, What's you your know, Spanish we background? Can't see, we can't see the forest for the trees. Yes, right. that's what you're doing. You're you're taking the trees right. instead of looking at the what, entire forest. I came in here. What's your listening? Spanish background? You what spoke it your whole life. Yeah, growing up. <laughs> <laughs> but I look, look. Wait a minute. I came in here without listening to. What Do you was have going relatives on. that only speak Spanish? Are yes, you one of those guys? Yes. Mm -hmm. There are some of them. But can't you so, take... So you really should know this language. Can't you take the words that you just said, even in English, mm -hmm. and just move them around so you well, can get I, it in the context of a sentence that somebody would actually say on television? Well, I'm just... I'm just uh, <laughs> well, Sam, what did he say again? I don't know. Let me... No, what did Mars say he said? He said uh, that the show has not so much a singing theme and more attitude theme. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Are you sticking yeah, with that? I'm sticking okay. with that. All right, G. Okay. <laughs> he said that it wasn't just about the voice and it, just to, it wasn't just about the voice and imitating. It was just also attitude. 
Now, mm-hmm. can't you, like... So did Mars sort shooting? of get that? No, he didn't, because he <laughs> took the words and literally translated them instead of doing what G did yeah. and, and processing them with an intelligent brain and, and giving coming, us, out, yeah. and oh, and coming out with shit. a sentence. Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Mars is giving me the up oh, and down. I think we're going to have a new movie trailer after this. <laughs> no, no. He's intimidating me a little bit. Yeah, too. he doesn't like this. Game. No, he doesn't like this at all. He might pull out one of his knives. Yeah, which one? This one certainly carry. See, <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, he's yeah. got one. If only he could say it in Spanish. <laughs> Fuck that! Damn, that's a good oh, knife, man. Look, you see that knife he's got? Oh, well, it's for engineering work. That's yeah, right. yeah. yeah. All right, go ahead. Wire stripper and stuff. Hay que ver qué es lo que ocurre ahora en esta segunda temporada con su retorno y su venganza. We have to see what's going to happen with the second uh, season. With this, uh, mm-hmm. rhetorical, I think. Rhetorical? <laughs> <laughs> okay. And vengeance. Rhetorical and vengeance. Those are the words that rhetorical I think. Rhetorical what? Rhetorical and vengeance. Okay, so we have vengeance. I think vengeance. So what is Sam saying? Uh, Sam, what is he saying? He is saying, uh, we have to see what's going to happen with this second season with the rhetorical and vengeance. <laughs> Is that correct, Mars? Why do you throw your hands on your hips like that? Because that's how I stand. <laughs> uh, hold on. Hold on. Uh, t- Tommy's got something. Tommy, go ahead. Hey, you know what you guys should do here just to show how much of a douchebag Mars is? <laughs> Get any, any English quotes off of YouTube, like any clip, and have him see if he can translate that. It's <laughs> <laughs> tough to translate it backwards. Uh, gee, what was said there? Um... <clears throat> The second season, that's not what he said. He said the second go around, basically. Okay, the and second go around. If he does get the second go go around, that he'll do it with even more vengeance. Vengeance. Mars? Mm-hmm. You might have got that one right. No, 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 no. Because no. he also added in. <laughs> what? What was the word? Yeah, uh, rhetorical. That, yeah, that doesn't even make any sense. Rhetorical vengeance. <laughs> rhetorical is like when you ask a question and don't expect an answer. That's why I said I wasn't sure of that word, but if he says something like All right, that. We're almost done. <laughs> let's get, like let's get to the end of this. <laughs> I wish Mars did a broadcast in his broken Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> and just threw in words like rhetorical out of nowhere. Can you do a can you do an hour of radio in Spanish? I can. I've done it before. Oh. Where? In the army. Really? Yeah. What? Sam. Really? For salsa. I mean I But you got but you can't really But it's Spain English. That's that's my savior. It's Spanish English. You know, Spanglish. Spanglish. Since I can't speak English, if you want to listen to Mars try to do an hour of Buenos Dias Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> we might have to think about that one. Mars does an hour of radio in Spanish. In Spanglish. No, no, no. Spin English. <laughs> oh, you didn't say spin English. Spin English. You can't even say spin English right. Spin English. You're right. All right, let's go. Oh, uh, shit. Una de sus metas ser el ganador de la segunda temporada de Mi Nombre Es, que parte el 6 de octubre y donde el verdadero talento es saber imitar. One of the methods of. Go back. It's... I understand. It's just, she says a lot. I'm obsessed with this for what? one reason. He said he okay. grew up with the language, no, and he has yeah. relatives that don't speak English, so he has to communicate with them. You don't have right. to translate this part. It's just I know, so we have then to... I have to think about what he's saying. Don't think about what this guy says. Just let it play. Sam, do so you know we... what he's saying? Don't kind say. Of. Okay, don't yeah, say. Yeah, yeah. But it's not it. about you. I don't look at you and think you know Spanish. I shouldn't. Exactly. Con su retorno y su Don't think about this, Mars. De sus metas ser el ganador de la segunda temporada de Mi Nombre Es, que parte el 6 de octubre y donde el verdadero talento es saber imitar. Sí, she's not stopping. I'm trying to. T- you it's know, one thought. Uh, even we know she's that. She's fucking throwing a lot of information. She throws the information, <laughs> the date of the next. Damn, that's a lot of information. <laughs> so one of the methods of the uh, uh, of this individual in the second. Javier, goal, we know his name. Uh, which is going to air on the date that she said. October you know, 6th. Yeah, all I that think. stuff. And I remember. that's where we're at. <laughs> that's it. Oh my God. One of the methods, October 6th. Well, we stopped it. We stopped. No, no you we said stopped this. at the end of the sentence. Okay, what's the method that Wait, so you didn't know the date. <laughs> what's the method? Uh, <laughs> what did he say? Okay. He said, okay, then what's the method that she's talking about? <laughs> all right. This is what I want you to do, Sam. I One more time. I, I, I helped him with the date. I did it again. I should yeah, have. Yeah. I'm a helpful and that's guy. Because you're trying to show I know. off. You're right. No, you're, you're right to yell. You gave me the evil off. look because you don't like being yelled at. No, you should have yelled at me. I think I was right in yelling at you. You were. Instant. Go back. 
one more time, this last part, and let the whole clip finish, because I think it's over at that point anyway. I think they just go to music or something. So what's the method? Let's get no, ready. No, 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 no pen. No, no, no pen. pen. Oh, you can't write this Look at this. Shit. Mars. Bunch Mars. Bullshit. You're... It's like code. You can't, always you can't write it. Why not? Why? Because the boss said so, right? Because oh. you grew up. <laughs> wait, wait, let me, let me, let me. Re- you grew up with Spanish. You, you shouldn't have to, to write it. <laughs> There's two. Yeah, there Anthony, are two. Anthony, bosses, can I write? Eh? I don't think writing is good. Okay, that's. Yeah. I think it's cheating. <laughs> oh, for two. Here we go. All right, to the end, Sam. You got it. Una de sus metas ser el ganador de la segunda temporada de Mi nombre es que parte el 6 de octubre y donde el verdadero talento es saber imitar. Well, uh, yeah, is that the end of the clip? Yeah, and then he just sings. Sings out? Yeah. Okay, all right. I believe one of the methods that he's going to use in the second go around on October the 6th is to be, uh, to uh, imitate, to imitate greatly or uh, accurately. Mm. <laughs> Why did I even say that? On the imitate <laughs> accurately. <laughs> <laughs> I love how, no. I love how <laughs> Sam says things sometimes. <laughs> Nobody Why would broadcast they? that thought. <laughs> Why would they say that on news? <laughs> so what did he say? I can't oh even focus God. enough to hear what Mars is saying. Mars said one of the methods that he will use on the second go around <laughs> on October 6th is accurately <laughs> imitating celebrities. No, that's what celebr- that's celebr- celebr- accurately <laughs> imitating. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell is number that? one it's not a complete it's not it doesn't make any sense and number two even wow. even if <laughs> that the thought behind what yeah. that sent that's not like a, a thought that anybody i don't think would you can say. put a period at the end of that spanish sentence and like even if it was like they're making oh, the point fuck. that he, what he will do in the second season is accurately imitate somebody yeah like why would you say that about a show that's only about imitating celebrities like nobody would make that point Mm-hmm. Nobody would say that's like saying one of the things he's going to do this season on American Idol is try to sing well. Can I mean, I have- that's what the show is. Right. All right, G. <clears throat> that she's saying what she said and what she's saying about Javier is that his ultimate goal is to win. And I guess they are on their second season. Yeah. So. And that, you know, the <laughs> that that's his ultimate goal is to win. That was the key to the sentence was ganador. See, Mars, you sort of like have last... some of the words, but then you can't like figure it out in your head. Well, he misses the key words. He didn't right. get win, winner, win. He, she never said method. <laughs> she, said, <laughs> she said ganador. Can you please? Yes, I will. I, if someone wants to. me to break down the wall, I already told you. Uh, when yeah, are you going to break down the wall, Ope? Is Sam really going to bring 10 minutes of a foreign language in with no prep? He translated all beforehand. No. Sam grew up with a fucking Spanish nanny. He I, knows I, I had a Spanish housekeeper that lived in my house. Housekeeper. Oh, God, a live-in housekeeper? Until I was like... A snob. 10. Yes. A snob. Know who was the live-in housekeeper in my house? Who? Oh. Me and my four brothers and my two fucking sisters. So you don't know Spanish. Time to do chores, motherfucker. I didn't have that Mar- many siblings. Wait, 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 That's wait, wait. What I want to ask Mars a question. Yes. Oh. Mars. Yes, ma'am. Could you, could you ask you. it in Spanish, please? <laughs> sí, por favor, en español. En español. Sí, yes. um, that was good. Tu, ¿Tus padres no, no te ayudaron a aprender español? Sí. <laughs> ¿Por qué? ¿No te enseñaron a, a, a leer y escribir el, en español? No, leer y escribir lo hice en la escuela. Wow. Yeah. You know, my mother used to make me sit and watch Spanish television. A little melt in your mouth. Read. No, wait. Oh, she read, asked. For those that read, think I, wait, for those that think Spanish that I translated paper. this ahead of time, she asked him first. Didn't your parents help you learn Spanish when you were a kid? And he said no, yes, they did. And, yes. And then she said, didn't they help you read and write in Spanish? Oh. And he said, no, I learned that in school. Oh, oh. boy. So you get Although to blame this whole school. thing is scripted, as we do on the Opie and Anthony show. Oh, of it's course. one of our bits that we do. <laughs> which, proves, <laughs> which proves the slums have bad schooling. Oh. And that's why I said my mother. That's, no, that's why I said my mother. Used slums. To Spanish Harlem oh, has Spanish. horrible schools. I, that's what Spanish I assume. Harlem. I assume that's where you were brought up. <laughs> Spanish, Spanish Harlem. The thing is, I grew up, I was born and raised in New York, too. So what's, you know, I just don't understand what's the excuse. 
Yeah. There really isn't. So you got terrible, <laughs> terrible, <laughs> terrible parents. This is nature versus nurture, Mars. <laughs> That's yeah, right. Parents should have taught you how to read and write and stuff. The, there is no excuse. I, you know. <laughs> so I has to beat up. I know that one. Mucho. So you know as much Spanish as I do, and I took six years in school. Probably. <laughs> it's pretty okay. good. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> I admire you. Damn, uh, that's a good amount of Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> I barely passed. <laughs> so did Mars. <laughs> yeah. Last year, the whole class was in Spanish. I was lost. Mar Mars was... He took Spanish in school because he thought he would get the good grade. But he was like the weirdo in Spanish class that was just failing. <laughs> what are you doing? He probably went, damn, this is going to be an easy class. <laughs> he got the paper and said, damn, that's a hard question. <laughs> damn, damn, I'm failing. <laughs> damn, damn, that's a bad grade. <laughs> probably the whitest... You have probably had white fucking kids doing better than you in Spanish class. You yeah. know what's great about this? What? That well, you guys assume that my Spanish was that great. I've never said that. You, but you, yeah, but you can't speak English. So you would have <laughs> oh, shit. But you were brought up with the language. Yeah, but, you know, I'm a New York Rican. A lot of, uh, well, she says... So she, am I. But so you know what? Am I. You know what? <laughs> we we bro broke away from that shit in the household. You spend more time out, you know, outside with the white folks, and you want to <laughs> talk with the white folks. Yeah. And, you know, forget that Spanish. Right. All yeah. right. But you have that horrible accent, too. Oh man! Oh, oh, she doesn't answer. like you, man. That's cool because I don't like Puerto Rican women either. No. Oh, 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 never. Wait, what? Oh, don't... Never, never. Why never. don't you like wow. uh, Puerto Rican women? Ooh, <laughs> there's a lot of reasons. You got a list? All right. Do Number. You, do I you guess... talk about your civilian? Because that's one rule in the show. If you don't want to talk uh, about your uh, what? Your Mucho canto. <laughs> Thank you. That's one. What's your wife? White. In what way? Ooh. In every way, in the right way. Well, there's, a lot, there's a lot of different whites out there. Way. Like, what, what is the background? What do you mean? Um, Norwegian and German. Damn. That's but her parents, Damn, that's but, a lot of white. <laughs> her parents were born here. It's grand, we're talking about grandparents. And you, I just assumed that you were married to a Puerto Rican. Of course, because you assume a lot. Yeah. Oh, 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 damn. Damn. Damn, damn. Damn, that's a racist host. <laughs> 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 Mucho Canto. Mucho Canto. <laughs> you also assume that. Yeah, what happened now? That I took your wallet yesterday. <laughs> you wow. Oh, shit. <laughs> First thing in the morning. Yo, where's my wallet? See, you're a little insecure. That was a joke. Oh, okay. It was missing, was, though. My wallet was missing. So... Of course, I'm going to blame the Puerto Rican. That's the joke. Me and Travis didn't take it. Yeah, I didn't think you it. Know. I didn't think you actually took it, Morris. Seriously? No, I'm okay. fucking with you, man. So why wouldn't you marry a Puerto Rican girl? Uh, mainly... For the same reason a Puerto Rican woman would marry a freaking Puerto Rican man. So you guys... Okay, what's that reason, G? That's for the same reason. Okay, what is it? Uh, you don't like Puerto Rican men, uh, women. What is the reason, though? What is it? I just don't. You know what? That's one thing we have in common. All right, I but don't like Puerto Rican men. I don't. Why well, doesn't Mars like, like Puerto Rican women then? Because she's not giving an answer. Right. Um, Quickly, because we got to move on. Because we got Jacktober shit too. They got that yeah, sassy attitude. Read this. But we got a great letter. But mainly, mainly is because they look good, right? Before they have a kid, and once they have a kid, they just let themselves go and they don't give a fuck anymore, oh, and they just turn out to be shit. some. Slops. Oh, oh. damn. <laughs> damn. They don't keep damn, that's a lot good. of sl that's that's misogynistic. Yes, <laughs> damn, you got a lasagna belly. <laughs> that's the reason why I don't have any kids. All right, Mars, See, yes. this is a good question. Then we really do have to move on. G, I'm going to let you go. Thank you so much. Okay, Bye, you. G. Yeah, there All she right, goes. The lovely G in Virginia. She calls from time to time. Uh, top five reasons not to marry a PR. Puerto Rican. Uh, they and then we'll go to break. They don't take care of themselves as well as a white woman does. Wow. What do you mean take care of themselves? Like working out or bathing? Yeah, working out. Okay. Working out. Um, I don't know if it's a hygiene issue. They, uh... They? they <laughs> those people. <laughs> those people. Have very sassy attitudes and will give you a uh, uh, fucking attitude all the time. Mm -hmm. And it's always in your face. Like, you know, like in your face. It's like confrontational. Confrontational. Yes. Mm -hmm. Like a regular a discussion would be an argument. Right. Oh, wow. 
especially if you're, uh, you're they get up on their high horse yeah and the head mm -hmm. shakes and I know, the head oh. shakes a bit and, and, mm -hmm. and, and like hit Rosie, me motherfucker like Rosie Perez gets all <laughs> yeah, sassy yeah, like yeah. that what you talking about? <laughs> all that shit. Yeah. yeah. That's Fuck two. That. Invite you to hit him all the time. Oh, hit me, hit me. Oh, boy. Oh, that's good. Um, I guess also they expect uh, you as the uh, breadwinner in the house to constantly uh, provide with Bread. all the fucking whatever they want, you know? Yeah. I mean, they, they make... Uh, <laughs> what does that mean? Damn, that's a yeah. lot of bread. I'm, I, I'm trying to be careful. I was I, there's a lot of Puerto Ricans that listen to the show, and I don't want you to have to. Right. We've been already pissed at you because you keep making them look so stupid well, today. Well, half of those motherfuckers oh, don't speak it? Spanish anyway. And we go oh, after, in the end, we go after oh, everyone. So, all right, so, it's the PR's turn oh, today. All right. Who cares? Uh, the, ne uh, the Puerto Rican women also. What, uh, why were seem... you being careful there? What's the real reason? You. They don't appreciate that you're working your balls off, right? They Is that what's yeah. happening here? And then you, they, uh, there's always oh. like, a, you, they want more. It's never good, never enough. good enough. There you go. You've had one. You know what I'm talking. Oh, about. I was in the Puerto oh, Rican yeah. culture. Yeah. Yeah. You've had, he knows. You've had one. <laughs> He's had like one. He's talking about an old Chevy. <laughs> <laughs> you had one of those Novas, didn't you? <laughs> we might have to go out drinking and, uh, and discuss that. <laughs> <laughs> I was in that culture for a while. Okay. I actually saw my ex at the time. Get hubcaps for Christmas, and you wonder why it's stereotype. Wow, that is wow. a stereotype. That is a God's honest. Damn, honest that's fact. a good Christmas gift. <laughs> Some guy who is sort of dating the mom. I don't know where that guy came from because they're oh, like, no. they're coming and going, man. But she wasn't oh, like that. But boy. it was like you know, always weird. This guy decides to get uh, the one I was seeing at the time hubcaps for Christmas. That's a true story. Mm -hmm. So you wonder why it's stereotype. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, sir. That's okay. But okay. yeah, that's three. Two to go. Uh, the fourth one would also be uh, they don't, they're like, uh, they, uh, how can I say this without uh, I'm trying to be careful here? Uh, they don't, uh, let's say uh, you expect them to make dinner, right? Let's just say, not saying because she's a woman, you just expect you coming home um, and they'll tell you in their face, they don't, you know, expect, you don't expect that kind of shit from them. They'll do it when they want, you know, that type of stuff. There's, mm -hmm. uh, you know, you know, you are the. Uh, I don't know. I'm trying not to be male chauvinistic, but you know, you are the man, and you expect certain things, and they'll look at you like <laughs> you are the man. Yeah, fuck you. Make your own dinner, type of stuff. You know. Ah. Uh, once in a while, do some shit. I'm trying not to be male chauvinistic, <laughs> but you are the man. <laughs> That's like. <laughs> Number one thing to say if you were male chauvinistic. I don't want to be racist, uh, but let me tell you about those. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, man, you didn't make your point there. Uh, yeah, they don't, well, you know, they don't. So like, you want a woman to be making your fucking no, meal every night because no, you're no, working no. your ass That's off. That's not true. We take turns in doing stuff. You know, you know, you got to help in the house and all that. But once you start helping the house with a Puerto Rican woman, uh, that's what's expected of you every day. Ah, so you better know. to just never do it. True. Yeah. I think Puerto Rican women, they all want to be uh, Princess Di. Really? Oh, yeah. Dead? They all want to, <laughs> they all yeah. want to be princesses. Yeah. Yeah. Want to be princesses? That's mm -hmm. why when they're young, they dress them up like hoochie mamas. <laughs> like the Tierra. Hoochie mamas. Am and I right? Yes, you're right. Thank you. Opa, you're absolutely right. Go ahead. One more. And the fifth one is they're fucking jealous. Like, there's no tomorrow, man. Uh, mm. Holla on that yeah. motherfucker. Yeah, this <laughs> fucking bitches. Oh, Anything. What you looking at? Who's calling you? Who's texting you? Yeah. White girl don't care, man. She she cares, but she knows she's, you know, she's got me in check. No, but they it take is. it further. You're so fucking yeah, right about that. I know that. they take it further. I, I try to be careful. You're so fucking right. We all have a little jealousy in us, but I think yeah, I, I think they have a, a lot more of it. They'll cut your balls off. It's been off. my experience. <laughs> oh, bitches will cut your balls off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Fall uh, asleep on them. <laughs> Don't worry, baby. Go to sleep. Mm -hmm. You fall asleep on your stomach just in case. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, Mars. Very Mars, good. Uh, gracias. De nada. You don't know what you're saying right now. <laughs> he said he wants me to stay. <laughs> so Anthony said, when he does the show, <laughs> speaking some of that span English. Span English. Span English is a great word. They're saying you got to marry one from the island. You got to get them before they come to the the country. No, Stat no. Staten. That's not true. <laughs> That's not true. It's the same. Uh, Daniel, what's up? Hey guys, how's it going? Love you. Love the show. Show. <laughs> Um, just to uh, tap into ADD Radio a little bit, uh, I thought the whole bit was to reference your uh, your newsmaking, your ink print, 
And uh, we went through uh, all the bit, which was a great bit, a lot of translation, but we never heard the reference to uh, ONA being mentioned in the article. You heard Anthony and Chris Cornell talking uh, in that news clip. Yes. Yeah, they're playing the YouTube clip. When Chris Cornell was going, holy shit, that's really good. I thought that was assumed. Yeah, I thought so, too. Uh, they never said our names, Opie and Anthony, but it was obvious that uh, they used a clip from our show. I mean, it it's could, a, you, you know, see Chris Cornell Radio sitting. Estados Unidos. Right. Oh, yeah, that's uh, all they said, satellite. Something like that, yes. Satellite radio show or satellite something? Satellite Tito. Yeah. <laughs> uh, my, my bad, Hope. I was hoping it was the uh, the reference to uh, Fox pulling up your, uh, your YouTube clip. They used it uh, online. Yeah, I heard they put it up on Fox Nation or something. Yeah, that's right. My Occupy Wall Street videos are just damn terrific. <laughs> now oh, you're God. now you're a puppet of Fox weekend. News too. Congrats. No shit. Everyone thinks I'm a right wing fucking a right-wing Republican puppet all of Fox sudden. News. I, I went down. Welcome. There. Welcome. I don't care about politics. Ah, I, welcome. I, I like making goofy, stupid videos. Well, but now I guess ends up on Fox. That's it. You're a right wing g- lunatic. You're like Glenn Beck. You're well, crazy. He he asked uh, me to do a stupid show. <laughs> yeah, see, there you go. <laughs> I was too sick to do it. I said, "Fuck you." All right, thank you, sir. Hey, yeah. It sucks though. I, now all of a sudden I'm a right wing. That's hilarious. And then I went down there with a with an agenda, and I only filmed certain people to make my point. I'm no. like, no, I went down there and I filmed. Oh, get that what clip. I saw. Get the clip before he goes. No, I went down there. He'll go. Right. I, I went down there with a right wing agenda. <laughs> <laughs> I hung out by the the weird red statue like everyone else. Yeah, and checked out the shit. Um, when we get back, to October right? October. That was terrific, but we have more ink to get to. Yeah, I want to. I want to get to this uh, story because it's it's a gem. What was the NBC News one? For some reason, they really. And yes, she's... they got my name in there. <laughs> I can't get credit for nothing. Uh, yes. well, hilarious, Opie Anthony, Anthony video. video. You said no. You said no. I will not go with you. I wanted you to go with me. <laughs> See, why would you go if you get credit anyway? Well, exactly. You just sit back. Sure. We still. It says a new video dregs. from Opie and Anthony. We oh, still Jesus. give Opie Radio any credit. We oh, still, boy. We still should go and do our own, man. What was the one before that? NBC picked it up, too? That fucking video just went everywhere. Anyway, um, uh, Jacktober. Jacktober, yes. And we got an article from a newspaper, and there's no confusion here. Our names are mentioned. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah. Throughout. I, got, I see eight mentions already. There's another one. It's, it, it's mentioned throughout the entire article. Uh, this guy, Michael Deeds, from the Idaho Statesman, did a little article on you and I and Jacktober and mm. and our listeners, the pests. Yes, yes. And we will read every single word of this article. Every next. word. Every word. And we'll also do a brand October. Holy shit. But first this. All right. Well, that sucked. To hear the Opie and Anthony show five days a week live on satellite radio, online on your phone or tablet, or even on demand, go to SiriusXM.com. Also, interact with the Opie and Anthony show on Twitter at Opie Radio, at Anthony Cumia, and at Jim Norton.